So you for me I was already there in Chireka Jam. Guys, finally we have made it to Nambole Stadium and these are our tickets actually. Yeah. Wow, so Joel gets Joel finally gets his ticket. <laughs> so guys, this is the current situation at Nambole Stadium. Yeah. Stick with me. Make sure to subscribe, like, share and comment. So guys, we are approaching the, the entry. <laughs> Check out that one is just so guys, finally I am inside Nambole Stadium. It's actually called Mandela National Stadium. This is the first, first stadium in Uganda and the biggest. When you reach here, just know stress turns into joy and happiness. Stick with me as you watch this amazing episode of Nambole Stadium. Guys, finally! <laughs> <laughs> Guys, on your entry in Nambole Stadium, have the main gate down there. We used the bypass, and this is the first parking lot. Then that's the mighty Nambole Stadium. Kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel. Make sure to like, leave us a comment. I beg, I beg, kindly subscribe to our channel. She served us without her, we would be here. Yeah. And also, Man, <laughs> if you can only hit the word subscribe, that's the best. Just turn the notification bell on. It's Never it's miss it. Subscribe and turn the notification bell on so that you'll be watching crazy content from me. Yeah. So, this is the mighty Nambole Stadium. Guys, I remember there was a time we came to film here. We were denied entry. We actually spent the entire day outside pleading to enter here. So. Huh? Yeah. Namgongo Hill. But this is not Namgongo. So guys, check on the parking lot. That's the parking spot for Nambole. Oh my goodness. Guys, just know this is a place where stress turns into joy. So, we are actually showing our cards here again. Let me look for my card. So, guys, that's the view of Nambole Stadium from outside. As you can see, we have a monument there. I don't know. I'll try to search okay. about what that. Then this is the eastern gate. We have the southern gate. We have the northern gate. And I have a ticket of southern gate. So come with me as we search for the southern gate. They are eight gates. How many gates are on this? So guys, please come with me. Make sure to like this video. Subscribe. Share if you haven't. And let them know that this amazing girl who creates content from Uganda. So guys, this is the Eastern Gate. Yeah, that's how Nambole looks like from the outside. I'm very sure this stadium is now 100% if not 99% complete. Oh my goodness, me I didn't know that the three phases of renovation, this is the first phase. So, if the first phase looks like this, yeah. that means the second and the third will just make it marvelous. Yeah. My name is... And never got access to this stadium. So, since we have got access today, make sure to sit down and watch the renovations on this stadium. Yeah. Joel, how do you find the stadium? I uh, haven't entered inside yet, but, but the, from outside the outside view, view it's classic. Yeah. yeah I so to show you I remember we came here and they denied us entrance. Do you think it's worth it? Yeah, it is. Let's go and see what they have been hiding from us. Okay. Woo. So guys, that's the stadium, and we are heading at our gate. Yeah. Of course, I have Joel Obatani. Yeah. And some other YouTuber, though I haven't got his name. Bro, come introduce yourself, man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you have this Russian name. Yeah. Mine is Okello George Eno. 
Just Okello George Eno. Ugandan. Ugandan. Guys, check his YouTube channel. Yeah. yeah. And let him know you are from Shami Vlog UG. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh my goodness guys this is how Nambole Stadium looks like in 2024 uh, unfortunately they are closed we can't have access to them those are the restaurants cafeterias in this stadium actually Nambole Stadium is the first stadium in Uganda and the biggest in Uganda yeah. when did the renovation start uh, the renovation started in 2022. 2020. Uh, yeah, but that is the first phase of renovation. Now, the first phase of renovation focuses on the floodlights and also installing of the new seats uh, inside the, uh, the stadium. We had the old seats that they had to demolish and then put the new seats in the stadium. But then the second phase is going to help us to have the swimming pool that they are going to construct here. Swimming pool? Yeah, the swimming pool. And then the third phase will focus on the indoor arena of the stadium. Okay. Yeah, so those are the three phases of the stadium. And of course, the parliament committee had allocated about 288 billion Ugandan shillings. 288 billion. Guys, 288 billion Ugandan shillings. Ugandan shillings. For the renovation of st this stadium. Yeah, but for the first phase, they released about 97 billion. Wow. Yeah, then we shall have uh, the second phase, they have estimated it to 84.5 billion. And then the third phase is coming with 105 billion. Guys, please let me know if all that money is worth that stadium. Honestly speaking, some other people are saying that that money would have built another stadium. I'm telling you, that's a lot of money. Like, it's a lot of money, yeah. Yeah, so please, you're going to tell me if that money is worth. This stadium, come with us. This is the southern gate. So, as you can see, southern gate, and here we are supposed to present our tickets as well. Oh my goodness. Like you can see, this is the southern gate. What you say? People are getting confused. Yeah, actually, guys, you have to be for thousand to use this gate. So if you have a, a ticket which is saying Eastern, you have to look for an Eastern gate. Yeah, I have a thousand ticket. That's why I'm right here. So guys, this ticket also has a seat number, a row. outside the stadium finally in 
Yeah. We are actually going on block six. This is block. This is nine. Yeah, this is block nine. We are going on block six. Ropey and feet. Eight is that side, but we should be moving the other side. Yeah. And I wish everyone could do that. Yeah, that's why we're here. It's not that expensive. But yeah. I mean, I can't move it. I <laughs> it's, you know, it's cheap. It's not very expensive. Yeah. So yeah, but just try to support you guys at football. Yeah. Big ups. Big ups. Big ups. So guys, see how people are proud to support their own team. I really didn't know that in Uganda people do follow football this much. So. Guys, I'm just actually excited and I love this. Yeah. This is the situation outside Nambole Stadium. That's gate block 9. This is 10. Is it called Mandela Stadium? Uh, it's called Mandela National Stadium because um, at the time the stadium was called Nambole Stadium because you know it's put here at Nambole here. However, when, Namba, when Mandela, the stadium was opened in 1997, and then that was the time when Mandela was... 1997? Yeah, 1997. Uh, it was opened by Black Edube, the, the reggae artist. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so after opening the stadium, that was the time when Mandela was just out of uh, prison because of the apartheid policy that he fought in South Africa. So eventually, to honor his legacy in Uganda, they had got to give it a name for Mandela, Mandela Stadium. Yeah, kind of just to remember the legacy that the guy did in South Africa. Thank you so much for giving us that history. We really appreciate. And guys, these are Muslims here praying. So yeah. they even didn't miss the pray praying. So they come out. Yeah. It's break time. Yeah, it's it's, break it's time prayer and time. So that's how, guys, Nambole Stadium looks outside. What are those? Uh, like uh, the restaurants that we had here, which have also been renovated. Yeah, so that's the restaurant part of uh, this stadium. Wow. So, guys, as you know, it's a stadium. It's a football stadium, actually. It also has a symbol of the football right here. Now allow me to give you some quick review that made the stadium to come into the aspect wow. of renovation. In 2015, uh, the parliament of Uganda, the committee of the parliament of Uganda reported that the stadium had registered about 3.6 3 billion in losses. And that means the, the management of the stadium was not going well. Then in 2020, the stadium was blacklisted from hosting games because the, the, the stadium had lost its share. And, they, and so in 2022, the, the, the renovation started uh, for the stadium. Now, the first phase of this renovation is what you can see there. They were working on the floodlights, which can allow the night games to take place. And then they worked on building the new dressing room, which I'm going to show you uh, when we get inside the new dressing room. And then they were installing the permanent seats. When we came here in 2022, uh, there were seats that were disposed out that they picked from the stadium. And now the, the seats that are inside the stadium are permanent seats. And then also they had to work on the surface, the grass of the stadium. That is the first phase and that is the key phase that they have worked on. The second phase of the swimming pool is not so vital because why they rushed it out is that we are going to host the FUFA World Cup. Uh, the FUFA that is in 2020, uh, 2020, uh, 2027. Um, we are going to have the joint host of Uganda, Kenya and Tanzania. We are going to be hosting the African Cup of Nations here. And these are part of the things that they are trying to do to confirm that this stadium is ready for the host. Mm. Just like we have that the Google is ready and been confirmed by us. 
also this has to be one by half. So guys, I want you to know that the renovation is still going on in what other faces, but the stadium is ready for use right now. Okay. Guys, we are inside Nambole Stadium as I had told you earlier. This is the outside view of this stadium. As you can see, it's a stadium, a football stadium. That's why we have a ball here, a football. Yeah, as a symbol of football stadium actually. So that's why you have this one. It has made of Uganda and some historical art on it. This stadium has several gates. It looks like outside and so far I love the renovations. I love the fairs. I love everything about this stadium. Come with us. Make sure like there's also a barrier so yeah oh. hmm? so this is get number 12 yeah this is get number 12 so yeah I'm, since you're here, you're supposed to use them anywhere. As you can see, we have full fuckers here. So I am approaching gate number 12. Yeah. Please, if you know any history of this stadium, kindly leave it in the comment section. Because personally, I'm going to try hard and get someone who will try to explain how many gates are in this stadium. So. Guys, this is block 12. Block 12. Mm. I'm supposed to show you your tickets here. Mm. No, they're not supposed. So, actually, I would like to walk here. I was supposed to show tickets here. I was supposed to show tickets here? Yes. If they are, if they are yellow. Yellow. Yeah. How about blue? Where are we taking them? Let me read on your tickets and I'll show you where you're going. This one. It's all over. Yeah. 11, yeah. 10, yeah. 8, Up 11. to 7. How many do you have? How many sections? 16. There are 16 sections. There are 16 gates like this. Okay, so you guys come. Come we go, don't go down, we are walking here. No? No, no, it's better we go here. Yeah, those are FUFA offices, that's why they have their cars outside. And the FUFA officials, guys. And by the way, the get 12 is for gold cards. The yellow card, those are VIPs. Yeah, it's a VIP. Yeah, so people using that get the VIPs. <laughs> so, Hello. since we are not VIPs, we are still trolling around our offices. VIP, yeah, these all those are VIP entrances. Oh my god, yeah, VIP is even far better than ordinary. <laughs> yeah, we are not lying them because they really want to see what's happening. <laughs> oh my God, guys! Even the the yeah, the friendly because you're tired. If you are not tired, they'll kick you out now. Subscribe my YouTube channel. Hey, I said they do what? They should send us some money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's those are VIP. That's the VIP section. Those are gates. As you can see, there's a gate there. Yeah. There. Yeah, only VIPs access Next that class. part. Line yeah. Line so we are still exploring this beautiful, amazing Mandela National Stadium in Uganda. We are walking inside the VIP room section. Yeah. Yeah, with the blue tickets. 
Oh my god! Wow. Yeah, I love the fact that currently they're not stopping anyone from filming anything. Guys, this is how Nambole National Stadium looks like in 2024. What are you waiting for if you haven't subscribed on this channel? Subscribe. Yeah. I think we can go here, yes. then we. Go. Because down basically there's nothing. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so, guys, we are going to access the VIP section, then we'll round till we meet the ordinary section. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> This elevates it. Yeah, it's good to be confused. Sometimes you land in the rich neighborhoods. <laughs> Joel, it's good to be confused and land in the rich neighborhood sometimes. Yeah. So. Oh. So you can tell that it's being constructed. So. This is also VIP. They also have washrooms. What? Washrooms. Washrooms ready. For the VIPs, guys. Also, so, guys, this is what happens inside Nambole Stadium, and this is how Nambole Stadium looks like. When you are at Nambole Stadium, you get a clear view of Chireka, Boyogere. Namgongo. Whew, this is 15. I think we. So I'm missing the lights we are talking about. The ones inside. Yeah. Whew. So, guys, let me know if the 288 billion Ugandan shillings is worth this stadium and by the way this is still this is just the first phase yeah so the second phase coming and third phase coming so stick around as we show you the stadium goodness guys this is how it looks like inside Ooh. Yeah. which team is playing i don't know man <laughs> so that's kind of